Hey, what is up, everyone? So, we're going to continue our uh, Fight Cade tutorial. Now, I'm showing you this because you actually play more games than just fighting games. This is Typing of the Dead on the Flycast system. And if I get my butt kick, I'm not the greatest at typing. <laughs> But just showing you how versatile the Fightcade emulator is as versi of games. You can actually challenge someone on Topping of the Dead if there is someone in the lobby who is willing to accept your challenge. Alright, I want to get out of here and I want to go over what I want to show you to do on this. Okay, so I want to show you how to... Uh, transfer this over to your uh, launch box build which i actually have this running on my launch box now before we get started i will go over real quick how this is going to go um so i will give you the media and show you how to install that and i have fight cake set up as a platform and as a um this is another game type, so I have my arcade, computers, my consoles, for my guns. But it's a separate game category. So I can just hit enter here, get into it, do it again. It's going to show my loading screen, and then it's going to launch into Fightcade. Now, there's really no other advantage to using LaunchBox other than have it just look a little bit more cleaner. Um, it's still going to pop up like this. I have it set in full screen mode, so it will show up just like this. Um, the way you exit it, I do recommend just close it from the Windows tab down here. Uh, as far as your games goes, you, know, you can get full screen just by hitting your Alt-Enter inside a game. And I will show you real quick. I was actually playing some Final Fight earlier. And it's pretty legit. But yeah, so you just click on that, hit Alt and Enter, and then you put your game into full screen mode. Then you can just Alt Enter back to set it. You can go to your video options. And you can just mess with the screen here as well. Um, but you're always going to hit your alt and f4 to close that to get out of your games and you can also do it to close that um, i prefer the taskbar because it just doesn't always close it that way it'll still leave it running in the background okay so anyways i've taken up enough of your time let's go ahead and get this started okay so for those of you who have followed my previous video what you're going to do is go to wherever you saved your Fightcade folder at. You can just go ahead and cut it. You can make a copy of it. Just whatever you want to do. Open up the LaunchBox build that you want to toss it in. Go to your emulators. And then just paste it right here. And if you haven't watch my first video and you want to do this go back and watch my previous video um, i've already moved this over here before i filmed this so i'm just going to hit skip files but for the rest of y'all it should just have a clean drop open it up and check everything's there All right, come up here once you open up your regular launch box and just put it on your platform categories. I just find it easier to start out this way. We're going to create a platform category. So we're going to do that. Make sure you go to categories. And we're just going to call it Fightcade. Now write your nested name, just put that as Fightcade as well. Uh, we want this to show in big box, so we don't need to check that. Notes, parents. Now we want this to be at the root. I'll just go through and check and make sure it's not checked anywhere else. Okay, now hit your OK. Now we have Fightcade here. 
So it's not going to do anything yet. We haven't set up Fight Cade. There's really nothing we set up for this. This is just going to act as um, the category that we're going to put the actual emulator in quotations in. The first thing I want to do is clean up this right here. As you can see, there is no icon logo here. So let's go ahead and find and create an icon for Fightcade. Open up your Google and just type in Fightcade logo. And you can put anything you want. Um, the only thing that you have to make sure is that your image is in a PNG form. So that's all you'll need to do. Like this one here looks good to me, so I'm going to go ahead and go with this. So I'm just going to take it, save it, image as, uh, change it. Yeah, it says a JPEG. I'm just going to use photo to uh, switch, change that to a PNG. So I'm just going to save this as is for now. Okay, and some of y'all may know how to do this, and for those of you who don't, you can follow along. If you do know how to do this, then you can just go ahead and skip this part. I want to open this with my photos. Okay, and now that it's open with my photos, I'll show you how it changes from a JPEG to a PNG. Hit the three dots, go to Save As. And down here below, you're just going to put PNG and change the file name to Fightcade. And spell it exactly like this. Hit save. All right. And now we're going to need to open up where this is saved at. Okay. And mine, I looked out here. It's just down here in my recent. I'm going to right click it to confirm that it's in PNG formation, which it is. Okay, now you're going to go ahead and copy or cut this. I'm just going to cut this. If I can find my cut. All right, I'm just going to copy it. Now we're going to open up our LaunchBox folder. Come down to your images. Come down to platform icons. Okay, and then here, go to your platform categories. Okay, and just go ahead and paste your flat cage here. Now it's going to be larger than these other images, and that's going to be fine. Okay, once it's in here. Okay, once you do that, go ahead and close your launch box and reopen. Once you do, you're going to see your icon right here to the left-hand side of Fightcade. Okay, now we'll continue on. We will need to set up the emulator, which will also act as what's going to start Fightcade. So, we're going to come up to Tools, Manage, Emulators, and we are going to add... Okay, emulator name, you can get whatever you want. I'm just gonna stick with Fightcade. The application path. Now this is going to need to be the Fightcade executable. So just go to browse, go back to your folder, inside launch box where you stored your Fightcade. And you want to select the flight cade number two executable. Hit open. And over here, we're going to put in a full screen argument. So just put full screen. Now, if it doesn't go full screen for you right off the bat, change that capital F to a lowercase f. We'll come back and change if this does not work. And just hit OK. Oh, come to Associated Platforms, and we're just going to type in the Fightcade. Okay, 
hit OK. All right, now hit close this to a platform. Right click on all, and we're going to add another platform. So we got our platform category added, and now we need the actual platform. So let's go to title, type in Fightcade, go to your parents, and we're going to place that in the Fightcade category. So hit check, hit OK. Change this to category, then you can change it back. Okay, so we don't have Fightcade yet, so we're going to need to create our game for it now. So come up here to Tools, Import, and come down to Manually Add Game. Right here, we're going to put Fightcade. Come here to Platform, and type in Fightcade again. Come down to Launching, and we are going to select Fightcade number two, hit Open. Come down to Emulation, and uncheck this. Hit OK. All right, and now we have Fightcade pop up. Let's go ahead and change our category. So now we can click Fightcade, and we have it right here. And you can also pull it down and find it here. Uh, we don't have any artwork yet. Don't worry. We will get that filled in as well. Uh, for now, I want you to click on it just to confirm that it does open. So we're here, we have it open. We have it in our full screen load. So go ahead and close it. So now that we confirm it's working, we can go ahead and continue and get the artwork here all settled in. Okay, so first off, we're gonna do the fight cade icon which I'm just going to do it the lazy way. You can go and find another logo if you want. Um, steps are just going to be the same. I'm just going to go ahead and copy and paste this just to fill that gap in because I'm rarely going to have it on Launchbox anyways. So we're going to go back to our images. Go to your platform icons. Come to your platform categories, then you can just take it, copy it, and come back to your platforms, and then just paste it anywhere in here you actually want. So paste it. I got that into. Fightcade, I'm going to go ahead and minimize that, and then just close your program, come back here and reopen it, give it a few seconds for you to reopen it so LaunchBox has time to fully close, and then just relaunch it, and then when it pops up, you're going to have that icon filled in for LaunchBox, or I'm sorry, filled in for the Fightcade platform. All right, and here we go. We have the Fightcade icon for the platform. Now we're going to give this uh, picture as well. Okay, and we're just going to repeat the process that we did to find the icons. So just find the solar picture you can find. Um, this one looks good. I might go with that one. So right click, save image as, saved as JPEG. So I'm just going to save it and we're just going to go back to your photo and edit it to be PNG just as we did in the previous one. So find it, right click, open with your photos. 
whatever program you want. I just know this works. Works easy for me. Three dots. Save as. I'm just going to title it Fightcade. Set that to PNG. Hit save. I'm just going to use it because I already have what I need pulled out. All right, and here is my. Okay, now find where you put your picture at. I found mine in my pictures. Come up here, right click on that. File management, open image folders. And we're just going to drag this picture and drop it into here. All right, got that picture in here. All right, now if it doesn't show up like this, just come to your image group because yours may show up like this. Once you do that, just go to your image group, change it to boxes, and if it doesn't refresh, just click on a different category, go back to your fight cade, and there you go. We now have artwork for this. Okay, and we're going to do one more thing, and that is get a video for the fight cade console, I'm sorry, the fight cade platform category if you don't then ever we go into big box it's just not going to have a video so i'll show you where to find one that i'm going to use and you can use any video you really want what is it just to get you up and running okay so i like to look for my videos in the launchbox community forum and if you don't have an account with them in the forums you should. You're able to download a lot of good apps, good media from them, as well as just seek out good general information for what you can do with Launchbox. So anyways, to get there, always just do Launchbox forums. Click here. Make sure you're logged in. If you're not, you can't download anything. Once you're logged in, have your account. Go to downloads. And I just like to browse through on the right column here. Platform themed videos. They just seem to have good enough length to keep as the uh, categories. And you can scroll through here to find one that you might want to use. Um, I'll restart the video once I come across one that I want to use. I'll show you how to download it and set it up. Okay, so for one I want to use for this video is called the Legend of Street Fighter video. I'm just looking for any type of fighting video there was. I actually went from platform to playlist. So playlist thing videos, you find a lot of good ones. You don't have to use this one I'm using. But what you do is just come over here, download this file. Let it do its download. Alright, then once it's done, you go ahead and open the folder. Take it and cut it. Then you're going to go to your Launchbox folder. And then from here, you are going to go down to your videos, platform categories, drop your video here. And then you're going to rename that to Fightcade. Make sure the name is spelled exactly or its video is not going to pick up. All right, now let's go ahead and test that out. So let's hear menu. Big box. Then we'll see what happens. Um, a quick note, um, you will need to use your keyboard for this. Um, you just really can't get out of 
not using it. Oh, and let me switch my... how it shows. For the uh, best effect on this, you would want to change your view to uh, platform categories, and I have mine to just all platforms. But uh, platform categories, we now have Fightcade, which I do need to refresh this. It didn't show, but it's fine. But as you can tell, we have our video here. Everything looks good. So I'll just enter it. Come to here. Still got some artwork to clean up, so we'll do that before this video is over. Well, let's just confirm that it starts from here. So I'll hit enter. Got my enter back in there. And we have 5K launching. Um, it's best just to close it from here. Again, you gotta use your keyboard. All right, now let me get out of this and we'll get the rest of that media cleaned up. Okay, so we are going to need to create clear logos and we're just gonna do it pretty easy, pretty quickly. So go to your images. We're going to start here on the Fightcade. Okay, we're going to click on the uh, box front where you put the other picture at, and we're just going to take that and copy it. Now, of course, you can always go out and find new thumbnails, but you know, we just want to get this done quickly for demonstration purposes. Clear logo, take it, drop it. All right, now we have our clear logo for the game inside Big Box. So, I want to continue to go back to your images again. All right, now we're going to come up to the clear logo, and we're just going to repeat that process again. We'll just paste it. There we go. And now, if the uh, gods are shining bright on us, we're going to start up our big box, and we're going to have all our clear logos. Okay, so we are back to this screen because the gods are not smiling bright upon us just yet. There's a one more thing we will need to do, and then we'll be there. Alright, so go on your platform, categories, drive bar, click on Fight Kate here. I'm going to right click on that. Make sure you are in platform categories to pull this drop down. Or actually, you don't need to do that. Come back to our folder, Launchbox LG. You're going to go down to Images. Click on the Fight Cade folder, and go all the way down to Clear Logo, and then you can just copy and paste your Fight Cade picture here, whatever you want it to be. I'm still using the same one that we've copied. Now hit your X, hit your menu, open up your big box again. Now the gods should be smiling kind of bright on us. Okay, so now either you want to see this fight cade box here, or just want to say fight cade, uh, that's fine, don't worry about it. And here it's just saying fight cade again, but we don't have a video, we'll fix that after this. So hit escape, and let's go back to your menu, and we're going to have to refresh our image catch. So go to options, go to image catch, refresh thumbnail images. Once that's done, then we should have our clear logo set. And we do not. That is awesome. Okay, first of all, I do apologize. It is like almost midnight in my time zone right now, so... This isn't the uh, most straightforward tutorial that I've made, but I still hope you all are following along and have gotten everything correct up to this point. So we need to create a clear logo for the 
quote unquote game, which is to fight Cade program. So just right click on this file management, and yeah, I'm just going to use the same picture that I've been using. Any picture that is formatted PNG will work, so you don't have to keep using this picture. Um, you're going to open your image folder, click on your fight Cade, and we're going to go down to clear logo. Okay, as you can see, we, of course, we had a flight K logo there. Isn't that awesome. Okay, so while I'm getting the clear logo figured out to show up on Big Box for the game, we'll go ahead and get the video portion added on. So go ahead and right click on the flight K game. Come down to edit and go to edit meta medium. Come down here to videos. And I have already added this. I want to go ahead and remove it. And so it will be blank when you get here. Just hit add video. Um, locate a video you want to use. I'm just going to use the same Fight K video that we downloaded. So, of course, if you start from your Launchbox LG, you'll go down to videos, go to your platform categories, click on that, hit open. All right, that's there, and that is it. Just hit OK. Then you can right-click on that to verify that it's saved. But as you can tell, it's already showing right here, so I know we're good. Then next, we're going to fix the Fight Cade Clear logo. Okay, we got it figured out. Uh, sometimes you just overthink a problem, and that's what I was doing. Okay, so what you want to do is you want to click on your, make sure you're on platform category, your fight cade category, then click on your platform here. Now for you, this will probably just come up fight cade without the picture here. So we're just going to hit this edit, and right here, we're going to... Just want to X that out. It should have nothing here. So just hit your plus sign here. And if you pop up with the 5K picture, you can just use that. Or you can just scroll through and find a picture. I'm just going to use this one here. Hit open. Hit change this right here where it says banner to clear logo. Hit OK. Now once you do that, you should have the Fight Cade picture pop up here. And let's test this one more time because I know it's going to work. Okay, so you should have your categories here. We want to go to Fight Cade. And now we just have all Fight Cade. Hit enter again, and you can just go in to your games, which is just Fight Cade again. Hit your enter, and we're going to open up Fight Cade. Now, to close Fight Cade, you're going to need to either hit your X up here, hit this. It doesn't really matter. Next up, escape back. Now, if it still says Fight Cade for you and you don't have the logo populated, because I didn't whenever I done it the first time, that actually worked. Uh, so it's your options. Come to Image Catch. Refresh all images. And then when you go back, you're going to have your Fight Cade picture there. But anyways, um... That is it. Thank you for hanging around through this mess of a video. Anyways, I hope you're able to get through it. Get 5K set up on your Launchbox build. Remember, use your keyboard because you just can't use your joysticks unless you're actually playing the game. Anyways, y'all have a great day, and I will hopefully catch you online. We can play some final... Some final fight, or you can try to punch me in the face. Catch y'all later.